this is Michael Wolf Parsons, and I'm here, <clears throat> here at Wolf Customs, Neosha, Missouri. Uh, I have the infamous Jimmy Doc Parsons, the cameraman. Give it up for Jimmy. Um, so this is a video I want to uh, talk about our burn table and some projects um, pertaining to that. Uh, first off, I, I have to give a shout out to Lincoln Electric. Um, our burn table is a product of Lincoln Electric. It's the Torchmate 4510, which means it's a 5x10 table. And I've had excellent customer service. Um, I, I just, I couldn't recommend them more highly. And yesterday uh, was a real treat is we had a courtesy visit by a, a technician, one of their main uh, technicians that travels all over the United States. And so it was, a, it was a chance for me to uh, get some more extensive learning now that I had my feet wet. And so there's a few things I was actually doing wrong. It was, yesterday was very uh, rewarding as far as uh, getting uh, new knowledge uh, and new techniques with this machine. Um, so like I said, there's a few things that I have been doing wrong and now I learned how to correct that. Um, I just, I learned so much, uh, learned some about the, uh, on the CAD program, and then I learned more on operating this table. So, uh, I had a whole list of questions and my technician, he went through and answered everything patiently. Uh, one of the things we did, we did, we also had some fun yesterday too, it wasn't all business, but he had, Matt had, a. Uh, several files, uh, well thousands of uh, files uh, for the table. And we put together uh, some real fun little projects. Uh, so we've got this guy. Now we've said, is it a lobster or is it a scorpion? I don't know. I'll have you guys weigh in on it. But that's that was a fun, fun project. It just goes together like a, a puzzle. And so that really, I hadn't even been thinking on those terms. So that, that's kind of given me some new ideas. Um, we've got a couple new signs. Uh, this is hot rod crossing. Now, the way I had programmed the machine before, uh, my torch was going, running too slow. So, and you think, well, too slow might be better for detail. Uh, but actually, it causes the torch to dwell on that that uh, material longer, and actually makes you actually lose your detail. So I was uh, taught how to re readjust my inches per minute setting, and uh, we we cut out this little hot rod crossing sign. Uh, and how, my, how thick is that material? This is 14 gauge. So it's pretty sturdy. Uh, you're looking at something that could be hung and last for a long time. Uh, and anyway, the uh, before I wouldn't have been able, this is kind of abstract, but there's lots of online cuts that detail the engine. And before I would have blown out this area here uh, and blown out this area here. So. This is a big improvement over what I have been doing. Uh, we made another, a VW crossing sign. So I like it, it's fun. Uh, the favorites are the birds. We cut these out of Actually, this panel here, again, it's 14 gauge. Tweet, tweet. And I put them together this morning. My loving husband, he, he cleaned up all the draws, which wasn't much. He got everything prepped for me this morning. And then I thought, well, I put it together just flat. We have a slip roller. So I rolled the wings. And this gives me an idea in the future, you know, I, I could cut out some feathers and tack weld another layer of feathers on the underneath 
So I'm kind of excited about that. This opens up a whole different world of possibilities. And this one's my favorite. I just think it, it's happy looking. Uh, again, the wings, uh, I, I rolled it this direction and then I flipped it over and rolled the tips up. And, you know, I think it would be fantastic to add an extra layer of feathers. Uh, this one could be hung. Uh, right about there would be in the center of gravity. Or, you know, you could put some, uh, build some little stick feet for it. So, again, I want to thank Lincoln Electric for their excellent customer service. And I'm going to make another video here in a few minutes, and we're going to talk about the Humvee. Thank you.